Question 5 gives us some data about some galaxies. It gives us the distance the galaxy is in millions of light years. Remember that a light year is a unit of distance. The speed away from the Earth that it is travelling in a unit of light years per year. And the time taken to travel that distance in millions of years. Part A asks us to complete the table, so we need to calculate the time taken for boots to have travelled the distance away from Earth that it is currently, assuming that it's travelling at a constant speed. Now this can be a confusing question because the units are a bit strange. Distance is measured in millions of light years, the speed in a unit of light years, remember that's a distance, per year, and the time taken is, is measured in millions of years. Uh, but ultimately it is just a speed, distance, time question. So we have an equation for that, we have you know that speed equals distance divided by time. And we can rearrange that equation because it's time that we want as the subjects. We get time equals distance divided by speed. Let's begin by checking the values we've already been given just to make sure that this is the right equation. So we need our distance, 990, divided by our speed, 0 0.051. Ursa Major, this should give us a value of 19,411. We say yes, 19,400. So that's correct. So let's apply this to boots. 2740 is our distance, divided by 0 0.131, which gives us time taken 20,916. And for Hydra, we have a distance of 3,960 divided by 0 0.198, which gives us a time taken of exactly 20,000. Part B says, how well do these data support the idea that the Big Bang took place approximately 14,000 million years ago? The first thing to note here is that all of these galaxies appear to have expanded away from the same point. They indeed have taken the same amount of time, roughly, to do this. So this suggests that the universe is expanding. If we look at this, they, we'll see that the universe, the galaxies, we can see that the galaxies have all travelled different distances. Taken the same length of time. That suggests that if we rewind that time, we'll find all of those galaxies in the same point. However, it doesn't suggest the universe started 14,000 million years ago. Rather, the data suggests the Big Bang was 20,000 million years ago. So perhaps we weren't right to assume that the speed of the galaxies is constant. Maybe they used to go much faster and have since slowed down. And if the expansion of the galaxies is slowing down, and maybe due to gravity acting between stars and galaxies. You do gravity 